time is 3.19. We also need to pass our exams. This is London Eye. <laughs> Good morning, the time is 3.19. So I've been just doing some practice questions on nephrology or kidney medicine because one of the biggest exams of my final year of medical school is coming up this month and you best believe nephrology doesn't come to me easily. So I deal with my weakest subjects first thing in the morning because early mornings are the times where I can personally deep focus the best. Also as always I start my exam preparation with planning and during planning again I focus on my weaknesses realizing I don't need to put much effort into one subject instead I allocate that extra time into the other subject where I struggle. For example I aim for 50 practice questions plus flashcards for each topic but for nephrology I might double that so hopefully I can get to a point where I'm good at all of the topics to optimize my exam results. <laughs> We did a quick change of scenery because we can. I'm in the study pod right outside of my room. Correction, my sister's room because currently I'm at her student accommodation in London. So it's quite nice. It's tailored for students and during my breaks I can go outside and enjoy London. Now let's get on with today's to-do list. <laughs> Right, let's get dressed to see the London Eye. No, London Bridge, no, London. Well, all of that, including the Big Ben. By the way, my sister is a medical student as well and this is the hospital she has her placement at and that's the Big Ben. How cool is that? This is London Eye and it's so empty. I've been here during the day and it was full of people. Perks of coming to touristic places early in the morning, you get to see the beautiful sunrise and there's few people to get in your photos. <laughs> Okay, here's our spot and I'm going to test myself with some flashcards and enjoy the view. I also brought a plastic bag with me just in case because you know sitting on benches in London or anywhere in the UK can get your bottom wet because it rains a lot. So this should do the trick. We're here to have our second breakfast. The place just opened now, but it already looks packed, so hopefully that means the food is good. You don't need it. Oh, that's all right, I'll wait 10 minutes. Thank you. I've decided to sit outside so I can eat sooner. I'm starving. Could I get the vegetarian English breakfast? How would you like actually be getting? Poach, please. I usually never order English breakfast when I'm out eating, but since we're playing Taurus, I thought I might as well go for the full English experience. I also squeeze in a few more flashcards, but not gonna lie, I get distracted very easily, so not all study techniques work well outdoors for me. Like, I can't really write an essay or test myself with long practice questions, but quick flashcards or voice notes work well for me. <laughs> Okay, 
Okay, I found a study room because now I have an online language class to attend on Lingoda. I'm learning French. This has been one of my New Year's resolutions for a long time. By the way, I'm just a beginner, so pardon my French and please don't judge my accent. Alors, Zilia, bienvenue à Lingoda. Et pouvez-vous vous présenter à nous? Ah, uh, bonjour. <laughs> This is my first class, so I actually okay. know nothing. Yeah, no. If you don't understand something, just tell me, okay? So my goal is to take one class per week, so I have a good understanding of French by the end of summer, just in time for my trip to Paris. Lingoda has classes available 24-7, and the teachers get you speaking French right from the start. Moma, November, Dion. Sure. Sure. They're doing a language sprint, which is a two-month intensive learning challenge. You get the option to do a sprint or a super sprint. And if you attend all of your classes, you get a 50% cash back. Join the Lingoda sprint to level up your language skills. You can use my link for 30% off or my discount code ZILIHA20 for an additional 20 euros off. Okay, let's explore the library. The exam I'm preparing for has 200 multiple choice questions covering all the topics in medicine like surgery, dermatology, cardiology, everything. When I'm getting tested on such broad material, honestly I don't always have time to read up on all the content first, but I always make sure to do lots of practice questions because exams aren't testing our knowledge but it's testing how well we can apply that knowledge in questions or in an essay, whatever the style of our assessment is. So I find it helpful to do just lots of questions and when I get the answer answer wrong or I'm unsure about something then I spend more time to understand it and fit it into the bigger picture for that subject. This strategy saves me so much time and I know it might be controversial. In an ideal world we'd study for the sake of knowledge but we also need to pass our exams so I'm having to adapt to the system until it changes. Finally, for break time, I'm meeting a friend. This is your reminder to please reward yourself for your efforts. I know it might feel like you haven't completed every task yet or achieved every goal right away, but we've done our best, so give yourself a pat on the back. And for long-term success, we need to enjoy the journey to maintain this and come back with a refreshed focus. I always misjudge how tall the branches are when I walk. Tall men problems, I guess. Huh? What do you want to get? Um, one of us should get a curry, the other one should get you know? a noodle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, chicken patty. Do you have mango sticky rice? Right? Do you want to swap now? Yeah. Honestly, my hand is hurting from carrying the camera all day long, which is really weird. I didn't realize vloggers get... <laughs> yeah, the struggles of vloggers. <laughs> Let's go, let's go. I'm getting... <laughs> How are you feeling? I feel okay. <laughs> Be honest. I feel pretty anxious. Why? You're walking in there with a huge ass camera. I know, I know. But yeah, I don't know how I do this. Yeah, I really don't know. Do you see some of her filming and where she does it? I would get so much social anxiety. I do get anxiety. I'm just trying to, trying to hide it. Alright, let's, let's go. 
It's like a sugar jelly. Oh. oh so try it. Okay, can we get that one as yep. well? Mm. Oh. 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 Yeah? I, I want some. Oh, you do a maximized flavor stir fry. Stir fry. <laughs> Excuse me. Did you choke on the powder? Yeah. <laughs> Maybe show me with it. Yeah. Right, I think Thank people you are think. more interested in the food. Thanks. This is the last piece, actually. Can I eat it? Yeah. I want you to choke on it.